After the unboxing, I went straight to work removing all the supports that came with the body to keep it uh, safe during transport and then also removed all the other body parts from the sprues to do some test fits and make sure that all the body parts align properly and then I could start sanding and prepping the body for paint. Strange enough, all those panels fit perfectly well straight out of the box and did not need any adjustment whatsoever. After doing that, I moved straight on to doing some body work. First of all, marking some of the mold lines off with a permanent marker to give me a visual representation of where they are and helping me not to forget to remove them so I don't have to go back after I added some primer to remove them again and just be sure that it's all nice and smooth and then move on to sanding it off with some 400 grit sanding sticks. Now that all those mold lines are nicely removed uh, with those sanding sticks, I moved on to sanding the entire body down with some Tamiya sanding sponges. 600 grit is good enough for me and a good adhesion for the primer to stick to the body as well. As mentioned during the unboxing, one of the letdowns of this kit were the panel lines, so I had to go in and fix that with my Yellow House Club panel line scriber. The front bumper came molded in one piece, but I wanted to do the lower half in a carbon fiber decal. So to make it a bit easier on myself, I separated it into two pieces, making it easier to paint and also a lot easier to get all the carbon fiber decals in those tight nooks and crannies. Now that the entire body is prepped and ready for primer, I test fitted the panels one more time and glued a couple in place. The front bumper and the side parts can be glued on before paint, so that is what I did using some Bob Smith Industries Super Gold Plus CA glue.
after doing all that, I can finally move on to adding a first coat of primer. Starting it off with those hard to reach, easy to forget spots, just building it up slowly. I ended up doing five coats, waiting about five to 10 minutes in between each coat. The reason for doing five coats is the orange body color. It kept showing through and I didn't want to go with a really heavy coat just to lock it up as I might have thought that would uh, give a chemical reaction and end up giving even more orange glow. So just going slow is my way to go on this after learning the hard way in doing it on the AMG GT with the white paint over uh, the yellow body with just a couple of light coats of primer. So for the first coat, just like you can clearly see the orange glow come through. The second coat the same way, third coat the same way, and the fourth coat the yellow or orange glow finally disappeared. the orange glow is still clearly visible after this first coat so I just set it aside for five to ten minutes to dry off did the entire body and just show you this uh, small clip of the roof a light coat is good enough the orange glow is still there so again five to ten minutes a third coat on the entire body and just showing you the roof the glow is starting to disappear but just to be sure I let it dry for another five to ten minutes and moved on to applying the final coat over the entire body and finishing it off with the roof and the orange glow is gone. Since I will be adding a lot more carbon fiber decals than the kit included, I just painted the entire body with a gunmetal gray just to be sure to cover up that orange glow even more and give a really nice base for the carbon fiber decals to be applied on top of. Later on I will be masking it off and painting it the body in a different color but it's a lot easier to do the entire thing just to be sure that the orange glow won't show through or give an extra layer of protection. Don't really know if it really helps or not but I figured what the heck why not try it make my life a bit easier and uh, see if it works or doesn't. So I'm just gonna go over the entire body with a couple of coats of this gunmetal, mask it off, and start painting the body color in the next video. <laughs> 